This short video will demonstrate the correct order for putting on or donning and taking off or doffing and disposing of PPE or personal protective equipment for healthcare workers in the primary healthcare setting. Adherence to this procedure will help you to prevent cross-contamination to healthcare workers, to yourself and to the environment. Before undertaking any procedure, staff should assess the likelihood of exposure to body fluids and ensure that PPE is worn that provides adequate protection against the risks associated with the procedure or task being undertaken. The order for putting on PPE is for practical purposes and is less critical than the order for removal. The items of PPE required are a disposable apron, a fluid resistant surgical mask and a pair of disposable gloves. The correct order for putting on PPE. So first of all, carry out hand hygiene. Alcohol based hand rub can be used if hands are visibly clean if you've not come into contact with or potentially come into contact with body fluids or you've not had contact with anybody with a potential or confirmed gastrointestinal infection. Ensure that long hair is tied back and is not touching clothing. Remove jewellery, lanyards and ensure that any skin lesions such as cuts or abrasions are covered with a waterproof dressing. Donning. Step 1. Plastic apron. Pull the apron over your head and fasten securely using the ties at the back of the waist. Step 2. Fluid resistant surgical mask. Place the mask over the mouth and nose and use the ties or elastic to secure at the middle of the head and at the neck. Fit the flexible band to the nose bridge and fit the mask snug to the nose and chin. It should be close fitting and cover the mouth and nose. Do not touch the mask once it's being worn. Step 3. Disposable gloves. Gloves should be selected appropriate to hand size and should be well fitting. They should cover the wrist and must be changed immediately if a puncture or perforation is suspected. It is critical that PPE is removed in the correct order to minimise the potential for cross-contamination. Step 1. Remove gloves. The outside of the gloves should be considered contaminated. Grasp the outside of one glove with the opposite gloved hand and peel the glove off. Hold the removed glove in the gloved hand and slide the fingers of the ungloved hand under the remaining glove at the wrist. Peel the second glove over the first glove and dispose of them as healthcare waste. Step two, remove the disposable apron. The outside of the apron should be considered contaminated. Break the apron behind the neck and pull away from the neck and shoulders, touching the inside of the apron only. Unfasten and break the apron ties at the waist and turn the apron inside out. Fold or roll the apron into a bundle, taking care not to touch the outside of the apron. Discard as healthcare waste. Step three, remove the fluid resistant surgical mask. The front of the mask should be considered contaminated. Untie or break the bottom tie or elastic first. Follow this by breaking or untying the top tie or elastic. Remove the mask by handling the ties only and discard as clinical waste. Carry out hand hygiene immediately after removing PPE. 
Also, carry out hand hygiene if you suspect that your hands have become contaminated during the doffing procedure, and especially before removing the fluid-resistant surgical mask.